Flight School is a leader in environmental stewardship, and we have created and maintained our 25-acre school grounds as a nature conservancy. Representing several native Connecticut habitats, our grounds are free of synthetic pesticides, herbicides, and invasive plant species. And the schoolyard and the school grounds are an extension of the classroom where the Nature Conservancy functions as a means for exceptional hands-on and curiosity-based learning. Ecosystem studies, biology, ornithology, weather and climate science, and so much more are at our fingertips, where students can engage with their curiosities about the natural world in a tangible and relatable way, through scientific observation and experimentation, but also through artwork and writing projects and of course, creative play. Slate School's commitment to preserving the natural environment as an essential teacher is nowhere more evident than in the ratio of buildings to open space on the campus. Buildings and hardscape take up less than one acre of our 25 acre campus and the remaining 24 acres, well, they serve as our outdoor classroom. We're excited to share with you some of our students' favorite spots at Slate School. The Piney Woods is a spot that we cherish here at Slate School. It's a small part of the 24 acres of open space that we have here, and it is a learning space like no other. Cooler on a warm day, warmer on a cold day, and always a peaceful and beautiful place for the learning of small children. They love to read here, to write here, to meet in small groups to talk about projects here. They love to pick through the pine straw and see what lives under these old trees. And they love to climb these trees. The Slate School Pond is a source of unlimited magical learning potential. The children love it here. They love it because it's quiet, because it's beautiful. They love the cattails and all of the fluff they produce. They even learned this year that the roots of the cattail are edible. Not that I'm recommending that. But the Slate School Pond is remarkable in so many ways. Just like how all of our education is integrated here, the Slate School Pond is the perfect example. Plenty of science here, as I'm sure you must imagine, but also some history and a lot of math. Recently, we measured the pond at 72 feet diameter. So 72 feet across this little pond might not seem like so much to you, but when we arrived at school this year, the pond was dry. We had had a very warm and dry summer and our pond, our beloved pond, was cracked and dry. So as nature did what it often does, heal itself, it gradually filled and week by week, we measured the pond. Until this week, it was almost at where it was when we first arrived here on the first day of school at Slate School. 72 feet across. Might not seem so big to you, but it's a very big number to the children of Slate School. At Slate School, we use all of the resources and what might for some people be a long driveway for us is 800 feet of blackboard. The children drew out the actual length of the Statue of Liberty. 150 feet she is, without her pedestal, 305 with it. But they loved making the whole length of it on this blacktop. The blacktop also has been used for greetings for parents and visitors and notes of encouragement for each other all day long. The boulders here at Slate School, spectacular spot for taking in the view of the school and the meadow around us. It's also a great spot for the kids to work on watercolors, drawing of all kinds, reading and writing. It's a great place for just thinking too and having conversations about nature and about our world. We're not the only ones that love it here though. There are about 25 deer who like this spot pretty well, and more than 50 turkeys. At Slate School, we've learned to do something called the Fox Walk, which allows us to walk very quietly and respectfully. 
this in turn has allowed us to get pretty close to some beautiful nature. It's just one more amazing thing that we've been able to do here.